Uh, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, thank you so much for attending our session uh, called Growing Up the Product Management Tree. My name is Debbie Wren. I'm an agile coach with JP Morgan. Um, I've been with JP Morgan roughly about 14 months, and prior towards that, I worked um, for a number of different consulting companies, um, including Tata Consultancy. So, here in, in India, I have done a lot of work previously. Um, and today, we're going to talk about growing up the product management tree. Uh, but I'd like to introduce my colleague here. Hey, I'm Ashish Medhirata. I'm also the Agile coach here in JP Morgan. I've uh, been here with the firm for almost a year and a half now. So, yeah, enjoying myself. So, as you can imagine, JP Morgan, large organization, typical trials and tribulations in terms of building product, um, keeps us very busy, as you can well imagine. Uh, before we get going, though, I'd like to just gauge where people are in terms of uh, scrum and product ownership. So just a raise of hands would help enormously. Um, those of you who are brand new to Scrum. Okay, no one, that's good. Uh, those of you who are using Scrum, so roughly bleh, anything two, two plus years. A member of a Scrum team. Okay, and anybody in the room who's a product owner? Nice, okay. All right, so we're going to talk a lot about product ownership today and certainly pull on uh, Ashish and my collective experiences in our journey to date with the transformation efforts at JP Morgan, but also to pull from our collective previous experiences in other organizations to show you how product development has changed over the years and some of the challenges that we've faced and some of the things we've put in place to try and counteract the issues that we, we, we uh, come across. All right, so first of all, I wanted to just remind us of our ag agile values, um, which of course go together with the, the principles, the 12 principles that we have. And really, as we look at product ownership and have a look at how it's grown up over the years, the past decade, um, we've pretty much moved away from or are trying to move away from a distinct area in an organization who remains totally detached from where the value is created, i.e. in our, our development um, technology groups. And I guess, you know, as I look at my experience over the years, that's where I've seen significant change happen. We're moving away and getting closer and closer to our development teams. That's what we're aspiring to. And those of you who've attended a number of the keynote sessions and indeed some of the other breakout sessions have heard a lot about product ownership and 